Paul Silver, and today I'm going to give you some suggestions on fixing this air. I will also show you a bypass to this launcher, which I actually think is better. Let's start with the suggestions on fixing it for this launcher. The first thing I would try is making sure you have migrated your account properly. There will be a link in the description to a tutorial on how to do that. The second thing I would try is to be sure that you have your email address in here and not your Minecraft username because it doesn't work that way anymore. You have to have your email address. I would also try making sure to type your password in a couple of times. I would, I might even try changing it, making sure if there's any caps in it that it's case sensitive. I think so. Make sure that those are correct. The last thing I would be sure that you did was after you migrated your account, you've got the correct username and password in there, and you click play. That you wait 10 or 15 minutes to give it time to load. You might even see a little, at least for the max, there's actually a little bar that shows you when it's loading at the bottom. Mine didn't work because of, I don't know, something internal I think in my computer that did not allow this. Make sure that you give it time to load before you freak out. Okay, so if you still can't get that error to go away, or you don't like this Minecraft launcher and you're looking for a better one in my opinion, I would go with a launcher called Magic Launcher. It's a third party one and I was a little hesitant at first but I'm, I'm really happy with it. There'll be a link in the description to this download page and basically I'm going to go through this, the installation of this. For those of you that would like to see it, I'm going to go down to the download section and click for Mac. The download for Mac because that's what I have. I'm just going to go through this ad really quick. Okay, skip the ad. And it's going to bring you to this page here. And go ahead and click the zip. I have already clicked the zip and downloaded it actually. It's going to give you this zip file. Go ahead and open it and it will give you the Minecraft launcher. So go ahead and open that. Okay, and it will bring up this page. I'll go ahead and click setup. Actually, I'm going to make this just a little bit bigger so you guys can kind of see what's going on here. Click setup. Actually, when you first bring it in, it's going to be in classic. But as you can see, classic is not the version we want. So let's go ahead and click 1.6.1, which is kind of the reason we're getting this. Press OK. Like I said, you have to migrate your account. So be sure you've done that or this will not work. Put your email address in and your password. All right, now after you've pressed log in, it will bring you to this very familiar page. It will have all of your single player worlds and your server list, so you won't have to worry about any of that. It automatically does that for you. So you can continue playing and experimenting with 1.6.1, or any other versions for that matter that Minecraft comes out with. I really hope this helped you and fixed your problem. Please comment, like, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Thank you for watching.